part of Edgewater, you can find Whiskey Girl Tavern that prides themselves in having something for everyone. Yeah, and we're tasting two boozy holiday drinks today with beverage director Meredith Berry. Hi, Meredith. Hi, how are you? Thank you for coming yes. in. I understand one is supposed to be a hot drink and one is supposed to be a cold drink? Yes. Okay, so okay. a holiday celebration and then something to warm you up during Ooh, that cold. snow oh, shoveling. That's on the way. Yeah, it's Ooh. on the way. Yep. It's happening. Yep. All right, oh, so yeah. what's the first one we got working here? So the here? first one we're going to do, it's called You've Been Naughty. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and we got a little bit of fresh lemon juice right here. Mm -hmm. We got three quarters of that. I made a spiced cranberry syrup Ooh. that's got Ooh, spice all of these beautiful baking spices in it. And I did it with fresh cranberries and some oh. orange zest oh, as you well. Oh, yes. Yes. Thank yeah. you. And then I have Jenape, which is an herbal liqueur that we bring to pour in there as well. Mm -hmm. It's um, You can find it in Italy and you can find it in France. Mm -hmm. And this is a Pinot de Charente. Oh, yeah. What? Oh, no, hold on, hold on. I don't even know what you're talking about right now. <laughs> you're like, what'd you call me? <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, it's from the Cognac region. It's just a really fun, like, wine uh, aperitif. Okay. So it's going to be okay. really light and refreshing, but just kind oh, of add goodness, some really a cool notes to it. From around the world. I mean, why not? Let's go for it. For it. And, and then, then we, we have got some gin. Gin. Oh. It's six o'clock gin. Oh. So good. This expression is going to have more green cardamom coming through. So, okay. Okay, this is all about those baking spices. I okay. feel like you are creating a concoction in the kitchen. Right? I mean, it's culinary too, right? Yes, it is. You use all the palate for these cocktails as much as you do for any type of cooking. Absolutely. I mean, it really is about building flavors, building complexity, just mm -hmm. like you would in the kitchen. And I mean, I know she's got Andy or like. Oh, girl, girl, oh yeah. Girl. And then we're just gonna pour it right in there. Look at that pretty Ooh, pink. That inner. Inner. You should imagine if folks may be like, why does she look so familiar? <laughs> oh. hmm. You might have had recently had an appearance on a kind of popular TV show. I did, I did. I was uh I was on Drink Masters. Oh, okay. yeah, on yay. Yeah. So you see all the handiwork there, and that's why. <laughs> it was a wild was that, experience. Was that a fun? Yeah, I was going to say, was it fun? It, it was, was wild, but was it fun? I think it was really fun. Like, it was also the scariest thing that I've ever done <laughs> in my entire life. Okay, so, look at you <laughs> running around that big old bar there. Oh, it is huge. It was quite the set. Quite okay. the set. I and bet you learned a lot, too, from the other folks on the show. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, the biggest thing is the bond that we created together. And there's lots of lessons to be learned. And remembering your journey joy in what you do. Okay. Yeah, yeah. In a moment, even in the most stressful moments. Yeah, like for that. sure. Yeah. All right, so let's get some joy okay. going on with this Beautiful. drink. You, you said you're going to convince me I that this gin like is going to be good. You know okay. what I'm talking about? And you're naughty. So what is it called again? You've been naughty. You've, You've been, been naughty. naughty. Yes, okay. I have. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're going to like it. Oh, that's good. It is good. Okay. I mean, hey, yeah, okay. okay. You, you've done some good layering of the flavors here. That's okay. really Thank good. You. Good Thank job, you. Meredith. Thank you. You have made it to the next Ooh. round. <laughs> and your next round is to come up with a hot drink. A hot PTSD? toddy? Yes, yes it is uh, the tavern hot toddy, but okay. it's, it's called honey time because it's made with a honey Time syrup. Okay, that okay. I made. So, so this is a few bit nice. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, this is a few bit nice. Yeah. It's a few bit nice. Okay. <laughs> I like the naughty drink, though. That's good. good. So, so you have that. Like it is, Over an ice? You're, are you doubly? Is that yes. more like a double boiler but with ice? It, it's basically, but it's actually with this hot water. So I use this electric kettle exactly, and I filled it up with hot water okay. to create kind of this low, slow, hot drink. Okay, um, that's that you can do behind the bar. You can do it with your guests, and then mm -hmm. I also heated the glass. Okay, Ooh. so this has water in it as well, very hot water. Mm -hmm. So then your glass is nice and warm for your Ooh. guests as Instead well. Instead of chilling yeah. it down, you're warming it up. Right. You don't yeah. want to have a cold glass, you know, with right. a hot drink. So, okay, so what do we got in there? So we have lemon juice, fresh lemon juice, the honey thyme syrup. Then I did a coconut pandan sochu. Wow! Yeah. <laughs> Again, we're going international I feel like, here. I feel like we're like the science experiment. Yeah, this I is mean, cool. why not? Let's get it. It's alchemy, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. And then this is an apricot liqueur. Mm-hmm. And this was the cherry bark <gasps> vanilla bitters. Ooh. Cherry bark vanilla bitters. Put this in a gimlet. Put this in anything. That's mm. delicious. So, so good. Okay. And then, of course, the gin. The okay, okay this is a gin. different one. This is a different one. So this expression is just their London Dry. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be 
a lot more citrus forward. So we have the baking spices coming through on here, a lot more juniper, yeah. less juniper. So it's not like you're walking through like, you know, Christmas trees. <laughs> <laughs> it's very, very palatable, super palatable. Okay. okay so we're gonna do a little bit of that. That's fun. In fine. there, not too much, but if you're feeling yeah, frisky, yeah, you can pump it up. Add more. You know, it gets warm and then it's super easy. We have it right here. We're just gonna stir, stir it up. And you're kind of, it's cool, right? Because you're water, warming yeah. it up. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. as you're oh, doing yeah. it. That's hot. Yeah, it's hot. Be that's careful. So good. <laughs> it just reminds me of like cooking chocolate over a double boiler. Yeah, that's there you exactly go. exactly what it yeah. is. Okay. Because if you get something too hot with alcohol in it, you're losing your punch. Right. Yes. right? Yeah, well, it burns it off. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to pop it, it in the microwave. Exactly. <laughs> and then, look at that pretty spin. Okay. Love, Love it. Love it. And then we're gonna pour it right in here into our nice hot glass. And then I like to take just a little bit of the hot water. Okay. And top it off. Top it off because it's nice and light and refreshing is mm -hmm. really what this is supposed to be a hot drink to warm you up for whatever we're not to get over. Over. about to get. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and how do you top that off? I mean like what do you garnishes you put on there? I do a little bit of fun manicured lemon uh, zest and then a little bit of thyme. I mean Ooh, the time it takes you to put that together. I love a manicured zest. I do Oh okay. Yeah. So can we yeah. try that? Yep. Absolutely and then it's got okay. the longer that thyme sits in there the more of like those herbs are gonna come out, but Ooh. Wow, is that Ooh, good? Yeah, this is good. I like this better. One. Yeah, this one's good. I don't good. know. I'm kind of I don't caught. even taste the gin. I'm see. So, see. This one's better. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right, well, you guys. Meredith. Gotta check out Whiskey Girl Tavern yourself. It's on North Clark Street. Whiskey Girl Tavern. The social media handles, the website, all you need to know. MerithBerry.com is her website. Thank you. Thank you so much. This was fun. Thank this was delicious. You.